percent of change or percent of increase or decrease is a mathematical concept that represents the degree of change over time. To find the percent of increase or decrease or percent of change, we use this formula. The new num number that is provided minus the original number, the previous number, over the original number times 100. Let's take a look at some examples here. From $200 or 200 to 600, what is the percent of change? So to solve this one, we have percent of change. So percent of change, let's say it's x, something that we're looking for. The new number, the new number is $600, 600. Then we need to subtract the previous number, 200. Then divide it by original number, which is 200, times 100. So just the formula, new number, 600, to previous number, minus previous number, divided by previous or original number, equals to 600 divided by, minus 200 is 400, divided by 200 times 100. 400 divided by 200 is just 2, and then 2 times 100, it is just 200, 200%. The percent of change from 200 to 600 is 200%. Let's take a look at the next example. 600 feet to 60, 60 feet to 90 feet. So 60 to 90. So again, use the same method, 60, to, so the new number, the new number here is 90. So 90 minus 60 over 60 times 100. 90 minus 60 is 30. 30 divided by 60, it is just 1 half. 1 half times 100 is just 50. So the answer here is 50%. That one was 200. Next one, 250 to 300. Again, the new number is 300 minus 250 divided by 250, the original number, times 100. 300 minus 250 is 50 over 250 times 100. So 50 over 250 is just 1 fifth. 1 fifth times 100 it is 20. So person of change from 250 to 300 is 20 percent. Next one, 50 to 80. So the new number or the, the number is provided from here, 280 means that 80 is the new number. Uh, it is 80. Minus 50 over 50, which is the original number, times 100. So 80 minus 50 is 30 over 50 times 100. So 30 over 50 is just 3 fifths times 100, you get 60. So 60%. From 50 to 80, from 50 to 80, the person of change or person of increase is 30. It is 60%. The difference, the new number, the difference is 30. And then if you divide the difference, here, divided by original number, you get 60. Next one, 80 to 120. Again, 80, one, 80 is the original number, so 120 minus 80 over the original number 80 times 100. So 120 minus 80 is 40. 40 divided by 80 is 1 half times 100, it is 50%. 50 
42, 50. 50 is the new number. 50 minus 40 over the original number was 40 and then multiply by 100. 50 minus 40 is 10. 10 over 40 is just 1 fourth. 1 fourth times 100 it is 25. So it is 25 percent. 